Hey, uh, welcome to a layout scaling video. Uh, I did this a long time ago, and so I'm just re revisiting it. Bottom line is on the left-hand side here, I have a, a house with uh, four lines. One, two, three, four, and they are whatever they are, okay? I just I chose different line weights and different uh, line styles. The top two, uh, th this line style is, um, line style is 18. Uh, the line weight's 18. This one is, I think, 150. Uh, line style, 150, yeah. And then I did an 18 and 150 down here, and, and I used a different line style, uh, sewer water, whatever it is. I don't know what that means. And then I sent a layout, and I sent a layout four times. I sent, here it is right here. I sent, sent it to layout four times, that same exact picture. On the left-hand side, on the left-hand side, I did not use layout scaling, okay? On the left hand side, I did not use layout scaling. I sent this one at one quarter inch equals a foot. You can see that. And I sent this one at one inch equals to 10 foot. You can see that. Now, what's the difference? In both cases, see this SW, SW, SW? I got four SWs inside that box. I don't know what that means. It's just there, okay? And of course, when you send this stuff to layout, you can use, by controlling your anno set and stuff, you can actually change the line weight that you want. But but bottom line is, I think they they downsized the because I did not use layout scaling. It did not it it, it downsized this this th see this really thick SW line. This is one quarter inch equals a foot. This other one here here is one uh, one inch equals one foot inch one foot equals ten feet. One inch equals ten feet. You can see it downsized the size of the text. I don't know what this means yet. Now look at this one over here. Now this is when I used the layout scaling. On the right hand side, I used the layout scaling. And this looks the same as this. What does that mean? I don't know. I don't know what it means. But here's the difference. This is different than this. So you decide what you want. You can see that the line weight for these lines here are the same as these line weights here. They weren't, they're the same exact sign. Use layout. See, it's almost the opposite of what I would have thought. But anyway, it, it is what it is. So what's right and what's wrong? I don't know. I, I don't think it really, I don't think it really matters. I, I think if uh, I don't use, I do not use, use layout scaling. Say, see, use layout scaling. I don't use that. Should I? I don't know. I think the, the big key is the dash lines. It's the dash lines that really get messed up. Hold on a second. I'm going to pause this for a second. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm back on. Now, this is what I did. This is what I did. I simply, I, I copied two of these lines, these two lines, 18 and, a, and, a, and a 150. I copy these in place and move them down to here. You see this? I move them down to here. So that's 18, and this is 150 line weight, and they're the same dash lines. Now you can see that there's a there's a very small gap right here. That, so the, the, the anyway, this small gap right here. Okay. So now let's look at what what happened in in the actual layout. What's going to be printed? There you go. There. I mean. Uh, you can see the difference. You can see you, can, you see this dash line right here. The dashes are closer together than these dashes, and it's a thinner line style. Uh, line weight, line weight, line weight. And you know you can always alter the line weight via the uh, layer display options. Which do I like better? I don't know. I, I think I sort of like not using the layout, use layout scaling. I think I like it better. I, I, I just, it just seems like I have better control of it, I think. Am I right? Or, uh, yeah. You know, I, I mean, this is, this, is a, this is a site plan, one inch equals to 10 feet. This is the floor plan, one quarter inch equals a foot. I guess the line weights get smaller and thinner and stuff. Does that make sense to you? It does to me. And I did not use layout scaling. And you know, with cheap, it's it's pretty powerful because there's all sorts of ways you can control this with the layer display options. It's it's up to you. You just got to figure out what what works best for you. 
And I think it works best for me. And my only issue, I think, is sometimes if I res if I rescale this, rescale this to one inch equals a 10, 20 feet. Well, let's see what happens. Uh, shit, I don't know. I don't know. Bottom line is I'm not going to use layout scaling, I don't think. I think I feel more comfortable with... I don't know. And the big deals with these SWs. I mean, I got a lot more SW lines right here than right here. I don't know what it, I'm done. I'm done. That's it. I'm not done. I will, I'll, I'll, you pick out what, you, what works for you. I think at one time this didn't work for me. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't get the difference in the line weights. At one time, I don't think I, I saw that. I think some other guys would agree with this, and other guys wouldn't agree uh, agree to this. But uh, anyway, that's the that's the use layout scaling. And and just just so you know, uh, here, here, this is where this whole, whole thing comes from. Uh, blah blah blah. Here, right here, use layout scaling. You, right there, use layout scaling. That's where that comes from. I don't use it. Some people use it. You decide whether you want to use it or not. It's this button right here. Use layout scale. That's the end. That's the end.